Hello medieval skippers, welcome back to another episode, it's number 6 I am recording right after I finish the previous episode because uh, uh, that guy... I mean the game stuck, for those who've seen it, the game stuck there but I left it like that for 5 or maybe more minutes and it uh, went back but the game did it saved, plus I wanna play again uh, so why not recording another episode um, Okay, I can go to Mr. Bernard here. I think I have enough money. Usually, what is the money? Here, 103. Uh, I know he can uh, teach me uh, more more skills so I can go uh, into battle. Uh, but um, I think it's uh, okay. -ish. Oh, and I fight with that guy. So I couldn't record it. Uh, the fight uh, started with the sword fight right after the hunt. Uh, Context hunting context uh, contest uh, and I got another point here perk point uh, blunt strikes means rhythm step slash slash what <laughs> step slash slash oh man short sword hunting sword or saber saber zorn ort with a long sword which is mine slash slash stab slash slash with a rapid zone how from the ox stance parry the opponent strike to the side from your left shoulder and thrust the point straight to the chest <clears throat> I know it might look absolutely easy for those who are not playing maybe even for those who are playing these kind of games I can't say I'm playing a lot of them rarely see me playing these kind of games but I love them because they are like historical am I uh, what? Why? Okay. Uh, I wanna see something. Quest log. Uh, where, what, what should I do? Sorry, the music is too loud. Uh, speak with Ber- What? Another- <coughs> Speak with Bernard. Thank God I, <laughs> I looked into the objectives here because uh, Bernard was uh, just about here. Hello! Let's take him from behind. Don't fret about it, lad. Lord Capon is a good swordsman, and if by ah. some fluke you actually won, well, you might not take it so well. Now go to the rat house. The bailiff's waiting for you there. All right, okay. Captain. A report to the bailiff. Uh, yeah, that guy Capon, Capone, Capone, uh, beat me. It was very close fight, uh, but he managed to beat me. Uh, that was what I was telling you before. For me, it's a little bit uh, harder to fight in this game, I and mean, I think it's not only me. Uh, depends a lot of how you press. I mean, I'm pressing, for example, to defend, but it's not working sometimes. Or I'm trying to hit with a sword. Uh, I'm not saying... I'm not, <laughs> I'm not finding excuses, but uh, it is just a little bit harder. Maybe at a point I will become better. Hopefully, uh, maybe we should run. Why jump? So, Mister, Mister, lady, let's go to the bailiff. I don't even know what that guy wants from me, or why am I going to see the bailiff? But I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that I'm gonna find out pretty, pretty soon. Where is he? Is he straight ahead? So, um, around here, maybe? Yes, I guess. Huh? Is this uh, him? Bailiff. Okay. So tell me, guy, what do you want from me? My respects do you to want? you. <coughs> My respects to you too. Join the bailiff service about our tape. Uh, let's uh, ask him some stupid What's questions. Like, like uh, this is a minority. Uh, in order to <laughs> get more points, who can teach me to read? I want to learn let's to read. Who should I go and see? There's a retired scribe in Ujits. He Ujits. can teach you. Thank you. Okay. Is something going on here? Master Bailiff. Is there anything of interest going on? 
<laughs> Nothing of interest to me, thank Christ. Master Bailiff? Master Bailiff? Come again? <laughs> Master Bailiff. I'm to put what myself under that? the Bailiff's command. Ah, under so the, the I put myself Sir under the bailiff. No, man, yes. No, no. no. These sentences. Very well, <laughs> Sir Radzig asked me to test you a little, and as it happens, you've come at the right time. We've a few disputes to settle. It seems some of your former neighbors have been acting quite inappropriately. I was hoping having one of their own on the town watch might help sort things out. Why would you listen to me? They listen to me, then you should look after us better. No. You can rely on me. Why would they listen to me? I'm not sure. I'm just a boy from a forge. Not anymore, lad. Now you're a part of Sir Radzig's okay. retinue. That brings responsibility. I think I chose the wrong. Uh, Have you been to see Captain Bernard? Yes. I have. He trained me and then Sir Hans Capon challenged me to a duel. Oh, why have I said I that? see. Sir Hans Capon likes to measure his strength against others. But be careful, Henry. Noblemen are quick to anger, and you don't need that kind of trouble. Well, anyway, you're going to assist my town guard. Come to the church in the afternoon. Yaroslav, okay. the watchman, Nightingale, yes. they call him, will wait for you there. He'll show you around the town and teach you a little about keeping the peace. And you need to stop by the armory to pick up some gear. Yes, sure. sure. Okay, so go to the armory. That's all? And dialogue. Okay. Master Bailiff, <laughs> is there anything of interest going on here? <laughs> Nothing of interest to me, thank Christ. <laughs> oh, I want to listen to this one more, please. Master Bailiff, is there anything well, of interest this going This is most perfect, Master Bailiff. Nothing of interest to me, thank Christ. <laughs> okay. Bye bye. So let me go to the armory. Game saved. Yes, keeping in peace. Can I kill this guy now? Uh, you don't have a lock because yes, I broke. Uh, I broke the, the last one. Very hard. Very hard. Open. Can't we find something else here? Oh my god. I, I think I should just leave better. Let's just let's just leave. I'm sorry, Mr. Bailiff. Um, Master Bailiff. <laughs> I will go now. Okay, so uh, let's see. What do we have here? Nothing. Uh, let's see. Optional. Pick up your kit at the armory. Not optional. That's. Oh my god, it's on that side. And then join Nightingale on patrol between 11 and. Uh, between 11 and 90. <coughs> okay, wait, wait a second. It's 9. Okay, uh, we have a lot of time. Okay, so this is where the A is, right? Let's see, if I go like that, I'm gonna pass it. Okay, so that's the armory. Should I talk with someone of these? Let's see. I'm not sure. I was told to pick up a kit here. Ah, okay. See? Nine. Maria Tanase. And? In fealty too? Sir Radzik Kobola. Your mother. Hmm. Yes, I've got you. Where? Well, come on in then. Make yourself I don't see a list. Henry, if my memory serves me, you're entitled to a helmet, a gambeson, and a club. That's all. And five swords. You want a kiss and a hug as well? I mean equipment. <laughs> it's quite enough for patrolling the town. You're there to stop trouble, not start it. Okay, I got. Come on, bassinet. A padded cough and a bludgeon. Okay. Uh, let's uh, keep with this one. Uh, like, let's change this one, even though we had one as well. I guess this one. Oh, this is very bad. I mean, it's fucked up. 
Uh, and we have this one as well. Okay. Let's just use those. Uh, where, where, where to? Where to? Oh, okay. Before we go to the church, actually, I think we should. Uh, we have plenty of time. Uh, let's go to the to that guy and take the ring for the <laughs> not for the master bailiff, <laughs> but for uh, the miller. So, guys, I'm getting closer to this guy I had to cut through the woods so here is the map so I cut I had to come from here uh, to here I had to cut through the woods uh, oops back here let's see <laughs> hello uh, you dropped something me sir <laughs> oh my god his face look at that face and the uh, not long ago you bore this convict. Try and get him out of this. Try and get him out of the house. What the fuck? Miller Peshek sent me. He's very sorry, but by mistake he didn't give you the full weight of flour last time. He says you should come and get the balance. That rogue. How much is it? Half a sack. That's nothing to sneeze at. It certainly isn't. <laughs> to sneeze. I'll go there right away. Don't go the other way. This is wait for a second. But recently, you buried a convict, and um, this convict. Um, he'll die on his link. Should I go get. play on his feelings? He was my friend. Get straight to the point. I would get. I would go straight to the have point. Have a ring on it. So I'm asking you straight. Have you got it or not? Lord above, you've got some balls trying that on me. Are you accusing me of robbing corpses? It's not a theft. Try and wriggle out of it. It's not theft. Try and wriggle out of it. What? It's not theft. I wouldn't call it robbery. They've no use for such trinkets in the grave, have they? <laughs> oh, okay. You're a man <laughs> after my own heart. I've got the ring. Give me a few groschen and it's yours. Oh. For, uh, 15. It's a deal. Here it is. Dead man's ring. What? This is nothing but an ordinary copper band. <laughs> it's not worth a tin penny. Where did he disappear? Hello? Mister? Hello? What the f fuck was that? Okay, if you left me there, uh, maybe I can steal something from you, my friend. Or maybe nothing? I would... I would keep... Oh, okay. Wake up, pig. Anyways, so uh, let's go back to, um, to the miller, I guess, and then at the church, maybe? I think we should do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. You discover mill. Oh, come on, really? <laughs> I discovered the mill. So we are, we are getting back here at uh, the... I never said any word, and I don't give short measure. I'll kick that fucker's ass. Were you looking to me? What the hell? What the hell was that? Jesus How come Christ this guy raised? Yes. I've got a ring. Can you teach me to pick locks? Ooh. Can you tell uh, I've got ring a ring for you? Good. Nice to know you're the sort of lad I can trust with a job like that. Now run with the ring to Wojtek, the Miller and Kohelnitz. He'll have some work for you, and I'll have something for you soon, too. A clever fellow like you will never want for work. At the very least, I'll buy risky goods from you. I mean, the kind that used to belong to someone else and you can't sell to just anyone. Stolen goods? Thanks, but no thanks. I'm not a thief. <laughs> no, no, no. 
Can you teach me? Can you tell, tell me something about the other Millers? Can okay. you tell me something about the other Millers? There's a couple of other fellows around here in my trade. Woodsek and Kohelnitz and Simon and Sasa. Tell me about Wojtek. He's young and hot-blooded with a short temper. But he's a fine fellow when you get to know him. His heart's in the right place and he's always willing to lend a helping hand. Unfortunately, he got himself into a feud with that usurer, the merchant Wolfram Pruder. A slimy bastard he is. And now they're Pruder. sworn enemies. Haven't I made what someone in town last Sasha? time with that name? An odd one he is, a loner who don't talk much. But he's as dogged as a hunting hound once he gets his teeth into anything. He won't let go until he sees it through, even if he has to walk over dead bodies. Uh, tell me something about yourself. Tell me something about yourself. There's nothing much. Will you teach me to pickpocket? Can you teach me to pick locks? Uh, to pickpocket? Would you teach me something about Let's the see. Uh, milling craft? Like how to get things out Before of I Before uh, this guy said, I'm not a thief, but now I, I ask him. Why not? You're go behind the mill with Patch. Oh, I, I, I was hoping to go with uh, Teresa, but okay. Uh, this guy, this dude, might be okay ish. Jesus! Jesus. Uh, meanwhile, uh, let me see what this girl is doing. I like to know what. I want to ask about Scarlet. A fancy. Uh, let's talk about. I'd like to ask a few questions about Scalix. I don't remember much. All right. Why is she staying with the... What do you want to know? <laughs> Turn around. <gasps> How do you get How me did here? You get me away? It wasn't easy. So Robard and his men helped load you on a wagon and we harnessed an old nag the bandits had left behind. The soldiers escorted us all the way here. God bless. What, what happened with me? The bandits, not with me. So Robard and his men routed them. They killed the few. The giant who attacked you fled, and Zibashek with him. It won't be safe. I'm gonna revenge on that yet. guy. How could Zib Why have done that? Do that? I never thought He's much Bishop. of him, but banditry. He was always a nasty piece of work. Doesn't surprise me he joined them. If you knew what he did to me. Tell me. When those humans they called them, when the humans came. Zibishek pushed me out in front of them and fled. He sacrificed me to save his own hide. That bastard. But haven't I saved her Where's from the, the humans I when I fled from the sword? castle? It's gone now. Those scum took everything, including your. I don't give a damn about the horse. I stole it anyway. But my father forged that sword for Sir Radzik. I promised father I'd take it to him. I have to get it back. Well, you can't. Just be thankful you're still alive. Okay. What happened to the other Scarlet? What happened folk? to the other survivors from Scarlet? Ah, they sought okay. refuge in Retay, and some of the Retay folk are none too happy about it. And Matthew, Fritz, and Matai. They're alive. I heard Matthias is at the stud farm in Merhoyed. Johanka is in Sasau, and Fritz and Matthew, well, you know them. They're up to no good somewhere. The only trouble they'll be in is of their own making. What happened to what Sir Radzik? Well, I think this question uh, Hannah, should have been asked before uh, I've been to this castle. To Sir Radzik, a place called but, Perkstone. Well, how did you get away how from the cumans? Get away from those cumans? I said to you, I don't You're know wrong. why I'm asking this. If it Sorry. hadn't been for you, when they came ah. to the mill, they slaughtered everyone and kept me for last. After you distracted them, I fled to the mines to find my brother, but he... So I saved her, guys. My brother was dead. I'm, a, I'm the man. I owe I'm my the life man. And more to you. And I owe mine to you. The scales are balanced. Yep. Enough I won't about trouble you Fancy a little talk. Let's I'd like go to. I like what? How do you like so, it? Oh. How do you like it? It's a In big right town with good strong walls, so I suppose we're safe here. 
And they took us in in our hour of need. I'm curious to see if I can how much longer find something about her because I don't know, but I have the impression that I have to bond more with uh, Teresa. What do you think of Sir Hanush? think of the Lord here, Sir Hanush? He comes from the glorious line of the Lords of Lypha. Don't Lipa. say he's a bit hot-headed. Uh, who's this? Who's this Sir Hanush oh. Capon? He's actually the real Lord of Retay, and Sir Hanush is only his guardian, because Sir Hans is underage and his father is dead. Folks say he's a spoiled young pup with an eye for the... Yeah, he is. How are the Scullies from the getting Scully? on? They're alive. That's the main thing. What do you, do you know about the Cumans? You know they came to Hungary from God knows where, and now they... Okay, that's, that's all. all. And fancy a little what are you talk. Up to? <laughs> Not like... <laughs> How would you like to, um, I don't know. Uh, Why have I read talk instead of walk? walk? I'd like that very much, but I ah. can't right now, Hal. Give me some time to settle in, will you? If that's okay. what you want. It's not you, Hal. It's just this isn't a good time. Okay. Uh, hello, Miller. Let's, let's learn to pick I'll stand pockets. here and pretend I don't know you're there. <clears throat> you try sneaking up behind me without me seeing you and take something from my purse. First, you have a purse. Rummage in the purse. The longer you do it, the better chance you have of finding something valuable, but also of getting caught in the act. Once you've found okay. something you want, you've got to pull it out carefully, but fast enough so I don't notice. Try stealing my dagger. It's there, mixed up with other things. Dagger. Okay, I have to steal his dagger. Let's take you from behind. Pickpocket. Okay. Uh, like this. Reveal. Oh, come on. Caught you. If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. It's so hard. Right it's very hard. It, those are barely moving. If this oh. was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. Caught you! If the this fuck? was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Try it again. Ten seconds, I need ten seconds. Let's Caught see. you! If this was for real, I'd be yelling for a guard. Shut the fuck up. Try it again. Shut the fuck up. Eight seconds. Uh. Uh. Woo. That's the Close. way. I hardly noticed you were there. I think you're ready to try it out for real. I was in your Best budget. practice on drunks and sleeping no, no. <laughs> So you don't end up in jail before you even get started. Thanks, yeah, Chef. sure. You're welcome. But I'll be having that dagger back now. Too bad. Uh, talk. I wanna... I, I thought he can uh, teach me how to... Pick locks? If I do remember, maybe it's training. I like to pick pocket. Like no, pick -pocket. no, no. Wish. I'll stand here and pretend I don't know you're there. Okay, now I did it again. Try unlocking this trunk. What? <laughs> I can't. Hold the lockpick in your right hand and use it to feel out. Got it? Good. Now turn the whole lock with the blade, but don't stop holding the tumbler with the pick. Otherwise. Start all okay. You forced it and broke the lockpick. That crack could be heard in Kuttenberg. You have to watch out for that. An experienced guard will recognize the sound at once. You're a damn hand, Hal. It's not easy. Yet. Remember, this trunk is only Okay. So, uh, what time is, I guess, it is, uh, it's just on time to go at the church, uh, to, wait a second, where am I going, <laughs> where am I going, uh, 
I need to go in front of the house actually. God be with you, Henry. And so with you, man. Okay. I know I have something in um, in the house in my in the coffin here in the coffin not in the coffin so take all i wanna go and sell some more stuff i like to sell stuff especially those that i'm not going to use anymore so uh let's uh i'm overloaded anyways let's go to the castle we are barely moving Let's first sell something to the lady here. It's a trader. Well, she sells other kind of stuff, but uh, maybe we can sell her the shovel. Don't yell at me, bitch. That's all you get. Finally. Okay. Okay. So now we get we we go back there um, <laughs> through here, baby. We are at the church, guys, but not for prayers. Uh, we are at the church to find that guy. Is this the guy? Night, Nightingale, the Master Bailiff, <laughs> sent me. <laughs> oh boy! Here I am. My name is Henry. We're I can't see you. To go on patrol together. I see you're kitted out. Ready to get going. I'm Nightingale. Aren't you that lad the mill wench brought here on a cart? Yeah. Teresa. Yes, she rescued me. She turned up with Captain Robot and his knights. All honor to the girl. She has bigger balls than most men. Tell me, <laughs> how did you pay her? Hope back? she's not. <laughs> well, I, uh, <laughs> I thanked her. That's not much, is it? You should go and see her when you get a chance. See? Oh, how did you Everything end up in the service of the bailiff? Pointing me to Teresa. What? What was the question? Go and see Teresa the meal uh, wench before noon. I want to serve Sir Radzik. So why did you end up in the service of the Bailey? I want to serve Sir Radzik. I wanted to enter the service of Sir Radzik, but he sent me here to learn. And learn you will. You're lucky, lad. Sir Radzik must like you. Most lords would have just sent you on your way. Come with me, Henry. We'll patrol the town and then check on the taverns to make sure they lock up in the evening. I'm ready. Don't forget, I'm supposed to try you out and, with the help of God, teach you something. So I expect you to deal with any misconduct yourself. I'll make sure you don't do anything too stupid. Let's go. This is our okay. church, St. Matthew's. Let's patrol. It serves not only as the house of God, but as the crypt of the Lords of Lipa, our masters. The gravedigger lives right round the corner. The priest, too. Our parish priest. Ah, a man shouldn't speak ill about servants of the Lord. If your opponent flees from combat, you can chase him down, grab, and turn him around with F button, big, giving eh? you a chance to finish him off. Oh. The bailiff and his hands were there, what was that? And our maestro proto notarius, the scribe. So this guy is giving me a tour, even though I saw the entire town in the last episode. But what the hell is going on here now? Go and check it out, Henry. If you won't go to the church. Go back to your people. Let's see. What are you two screeching about? Stop making such a ruckus. About time you turned up. This filthy beggar thinks. My name is Jane. No one cares what your name is. This filthy beggar thinks she can come and stink in front of my shop. I want you to get rid of her. She can come and stink in front of my shop. What? How is she bothering you, master? Do you have to beg right here, Jane? You call yourself a Christian armor? Drive the beggar away. You should let her stay, master armor. Sort it out between you. What is your name? Your name is a filthy beggar. I think she can. Okay. Let's see. What's the problem here? This is my shop. 
and I won't have beggars sitting on my doorstep. Let her go and squat in the square. She won't be in anyone's way there, and there's plenty of folk to beg from. Must you sit here, of all places? Yes, I do. Why? Why? Folk drive me away wherever I sit. I can't keep walking all day and night. That's great. A bit of extra coin never hurt. If I say drive the beggar away, then I, I might be the nasty guy. If I said you call yourself a Christian armor, this guy would be pissed off or something. You should let her stay master armor. I think you ought to leave the poor woman be. Ha 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 ha. Why should I? Yeah, why should? Uh, are you sure you, everything in your business is in order? Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, because I told you to. Should I be a bad guy? Because I told you to. Do you think I was born yesterday, youngster? I know my rights, and if you don't drive her away, I will. With a whip. Watch your step, Armourer. Raise a hand to that girl and you'll feel the full weight of the law. Ha! Think Damn. I'm afraid of you. Crap. Look at yourself, a ragged refugee. No one here will listen to you. I've lived here my whole life. I'm a respected trader, and I won't have beggars in front of my shop. As you wish, Amra. Oh, don't tell me I'm gonna kick this guy. Can't you show us some Christian charity, Amra? What? Have you any idea how much I've given away in alms, even to this... Is that true? Might be. Might not. Did you get any alms or not? Okay. Yes. From the armor I don't know here. what alms is. I don't know. And even if I did, that was yesterday, and my belly's empty again today. Ah, something for it. Okay. What would you know about it? Judy will never believe me. I saw Margrave drop. I knew the minute I saw him. We're both good Christians, aren't we? We should each give something to the poor soul. And what then? Then Jane will be on her way. Immediately. King Solomon now, are you, lad? Fine. Fine, have it your way. Okay, okay. <laughs> we solved the problem. You and, and you too, citizen. I won't be a nuisance no more, really. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Jesus. You're as bad as each other. Can I slam the shit out of you? What was that? <laughs> Not you know what would be here. really cool they about this? Okay, have you finished? Okay, uh, if we could take some of the beggars, for example, Here's give the them force. some clothes, the weapons, some and make like a not a your own friend. squad, you know, and go out there. That, that would be really cool. You I don't think this is a thing us. in this game, but you you and your master, or your father, that would be really, really cool. Hey. What is it, man? My father was the master blacksmith. He was killed in Skalix. Ah, I'm sorry. I didn't know. Thank you. So am I. My papa died not long ago. Of course, it was old age got him. That's not the same, but I know a little how you feel. What are you doing? God be with you, Benesh. How goes it? Well enough, Nightingale. It's quiet as we know. Good. Where's Moimir, anyway? Isn't he supposed to be here? Oh, I'm to this. I'm from Skalitz, then. Well, oh, I see. Now, where might he have got to, then? Everyone is talking. <laughs> you don't know, eh? Let me tell you something. When the bailiff finds out Moimir's slacking off, he'll be in serious shit. Honda? What? Some of sometimes. What do you need? The names. Who? Is, how is that? What is it happening, Scully? Find out. Folks, eh? How? I suppose. Yeah. Let's go and find that idler, and you'd better talk some sense into him. Okay. Let's find someone. 
I'm trying to cut a part of, a part of this. It's very, very boring to just stay and walk about it. So I'm, I'm gonna cut. I'm, I'm, I cut from all the scenes. Where is this? Oh, we are looking for this. <laughs> The music is so loud. Move your carcass and don't guard the gate. Uh, I... Not a word. Get moving. You're lucky it was me found out, not the bailiff. Oh, God forbid, Captain Bernard. Out! Come and sit with me, Henry. Let's have a drink. What? See, what the crap? I mean, <laughs> you just told that guy to, to leave and... Then we sit and drink as well. Fool got me all worked up. I'm sure he did. Shouldn't we be on patrol? Or me too? What should I say to this guy? Shouldn't we be on patrol instead of drinking? You're eager, aren't you? Don't worry. Even watchmen are entitled to a break. Except the one that's on what the gate that the guy was doing. But that's enough about that. Let's not let it spoil our day. Listen, since we're sitting here anyway, how about a little game? Just one more thing and we're done for the night. Okay. Ringing the end of the day and closing the taverns. Isn't it still a bit early? What, what the hell are you doing? I don't know how it was in Scarlet's, but here in Rate we close up at this hour. Except, of course, during fairs and big festivals. Then we don't close at all. Very See, early. <laughs> should I go and ring the bell? If you wouldn't mind, the bell is hanging outside the rat house. Ring three times, then go to the trader's tavern by the market square and make the sure the hell? innkeeper closes up. I'll do that. Before I forget, it's forbidden to walk in Rate at night without a torch. Here, take this one. It's forbidden? Are you kidding me? Uh, let's uh, ring the bell. Okay, I understood. Hey, what? Uh, uh, where is the torch? Okay, uh, a keep, I guess. Be a bit more careful. <clears throat> uh, J. Ring the bell. Let that. Be. Oh, okay, where is that? Okay, in this way. Move, lady. Everyone, get your torches. Where is your torch, my friend? Why don't you have a torch? Ooh. There is something stinky with this Pruda. I do remember uh, the Miller said something to me, right? About Rate, okay. I was hoping uh, something else would be in the dialogue for us, but I think it was not. Can I set someone on fire? Look at this Robin Hood! <laughs> Taylor. Oh, that's cute. People are walking with those things. Little lamps. I'm gonna stream this game at... Hey, where is it? Here is it. Use. I want to stream this game, but I need a better video card, so I'm uh, trying to buy one pretty soon. Hopefully, who knows? Close the trader's tavern. Okay, let's go to the tavern. Uh, map. I want to be sure I'm going to take. Uh, oh, okay, back from where I came. Okay. Uh, so. Uh, and what could he do to cause it anyway? What do I know? I don't make wheels. Maybe he fixed it with bad wood. Don't let your What's imagination run away with you. Be a bit more careful. What's happening here? Can I? Do I have to in intervene? And slap the back chat of you guys. Be with you. And so with you. At, okay. Sorry for. <laughs> sorry for Master Bailiff. Where is that? Tavern here. Oh, we have a... We have a cinematic starting here. Hmm. Nasty. I have to beat someone, I guess. 
And the cannon of St. Wenceslas in Olomouc was so drunk. Oh, not too. He dragged the pig to the market square, saddled it up, <laughs> and rode it out of the town gate. <laughs> 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 no, 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 we can, we can see, we can see that this wasn't going to end well. So, Sir Peter and I rode off to look for the good cannon on his pig. <laughs> they do find him. <laughs> we tracked the filthy beast down to a sty beyond Cronau. I mean, the beast with a tonsier on its head. <laughs> we never found the real pig, but the Reverend was sound asleep in the pig sty. <laughs> Birds of a feather stick together. <laughs> it seems the same goes for pigs and planets. <laughs> <laughs> I toast, gentlemen, to pigs and planets. <laughs> God save their bacon. <laughs> Sir Hans, forgive my intrusion, but I need... Oh, but what? You uh, want to join us? Want to <laughs> buy us around? <laughs> I'm afraid we don't drink with peasants. You're not in your village now, boy. No, sir. <laughs> Curfew's been rung. The alehouse is closing. <laughs> Nothing closes while I'm sitting here. If that's all, you're dismissed. Are you out of your mind, lad? You uh, apparently I am, him. yeah. He's got a temper like a bear with gut egg. If I was you, I'd get lost before he shows it. The bailiff instructed me to close the tavern at the proper hour. He doesn't want anyone disturbing the peace after curfew. The bailiff? The bailiff can The master bailiff. <laughs> I trust you haven't forgotten who's the rightful lord of Ratte. No, it's Sir Hannes. Oh, is he here? Or is he hiding under the table, maybe? <laughs> no! Then what, what he wants isn't but. worth a fart in a bathhouse. And besides, he's only in charge till I grow up. <sighs> Which clearly hasn't happened yet. Enough! You can't talk to me like that. I'm a nobleman. Come now, sirs. You're not going to fight here, are you? We most definitely are. Ooh. This yokel needs to be taught his place. What? Really? Are we going to fight? Maybe this time I'm gonna f beat the crap out of this guy. I'll bring it right away. That's going to cost you your life. <laughs> Go on, Your Grace, show him what for. Oh, crap. Let him yeah. have it, Sir Hans. That'll uh. help us all <laughs> Crucifix! <laughs> what in the name of Christ is happening here? Oh, man. Help! Answer me, damn you! This peasant insulted me. I had to teach him a lesson. By rolling around in the mud like a hog? That's a fine example of noble conduct. Sir Hannes, the bailiff ordered me to... Silence! You shut your mouth and thank your lucky stars that you are Radzig's ward. Have you gone out of your mind? Raising your hand to a nobleman? <laughs> and yeah! You how many times shlop, have I told shlop, you that shlop. drinking with your subjects might be good for their morale, but it's bad for your honor? <sighs> you spend all your days drinking and chasing wenches, which wouldn't matter if you paid any attention at all to your duties. And now we see what that leads to. Tomorrow, you will go with me to a hearing. Some landowners have asked me to settle a dispute. It'll be an excellent lesson for you. I had planned to go hunting, but if you think listening to the pointless gripes of a bunch of old fools will benefit me, so be it. Oh, hunting. Well then, Your Grace, I'll tell you what. You can go hunting. Really? Oh, naturally. Who am I to deprive <laughs> the young Lord Capon of his sport? And you can take Henry here as your page. Oh, no, then, no, 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 no. Absolutely not. You'll do as I've commanded. It's time you learned how to lead people, and not just in drinking and brawling. Now get out of my sight. I think I'm gonna beat the crap out of this guy so in I the have woods. Responsibilities of the bailiff. Not I anymore. Can't... Your responsibilities now are the Lord Capon. It's time you learned how to behave in the presence of nobility. Let's go. Tell the kitchen I'm hungry. It's been a long journey. <laughs> the fat's all. It's hungry.
game saved well guys i think it's time to end this video here uh we are we kept the pace in the in the city here in the town uh quest started the prey well i have to meet with that capon guy and uh, i have to add dawn in the courtyard so uh guys don't forget to leave a like uh don't forget to leave a comment if you do enjoy this and uh see you next time because there will be more of kingdom come deliverance and uh i salute you